Hi, Debra, how are you? Hi, Debra, this is Amanda. Hello, Hello Debra. Debra. You yeah, are welcome to Jamestown. As this is the heart of Jamestown. Debra, you are welcome to Jamestown once again. And this is where we have, this is where most of our stories and other things come from. And, yeah, and where we are standing just recently, we used to have our performances here, and this is also called the runabout, Jamestown runabout, and we normally have some performances here during the day all the time. And you asked us whether we've been selling our performances outside. Yes, we've been taking our performances to schools, churches, hospitals, and in the community as well. And in the community, we do your most popular theatre called Invisible. Yeah, that's called Invisible Theatre. That with that, we just don't invite anybody. We just come into the community and start with our performers. And in the case, you see people coming together, and by the time we realize, all of them will come and gather, and we start with the performance for them. And that's what we call Invisible Theatre. And then it's very, very interesting. Because we need to have much of an impact. Hello, Hello Deborah. Welcome, Welcome to Jamestown. And this is where we have our workshops and performances here. And this is a bit of the community where most of our stories come from, as you asked earlier on. Yeah, so like we said, the community theatre centre, this is where we've been having our workshops every weekend. And as you can see, some of our participants are there waiting. And as you said, how do we get our stories? Our stories is based on true life experiences of the people in the community. We asked our performers to go out to the community to reach out and ask about true life experiences of people who have just passed through the stage of teenage pregnancy. So with this, they record all those thoughts about the people on a sheet of paper, bring it back, then we, we read it to the group in large, take some parts of it, then we develop a story on their experiences. Yeah, like Foster just said, our stories, our dramas, our performances are based on experiences of the people of Jamestown and our participants as well. Since we do, we have research on the stories, HIV, AIDS, teenage pregnancy, human rights, and among others, and so this can tell you that our stories are all not fiction, but just real life experiences of the people of Jamestown. And like you said, he said we should show you up about is said to show you how we handle our workshops and other things so you can just watch us go into the jamestown theater center to have our workshop yeah and today we <laughs> and in this workshop today we would like to show you three aspects of the workshop what we've been doing in our workshops one would have in, would have results on our performances and select some of the scenes for you to see how it goes and then also would like to reveal some of the workshop activities as you've been asking you said you don't know of um, the bra day there with that activity that we showed to you so would have that one for you to see it and also to add to that we'll be doing as he said what's fishbowl so we'll introduce a forum on fishbowl for you and so as we said before you are about to see our workshop and we hope you are going to like it very much enjoy yourself see you on. We, we are about to start with our workshop and you are warmly welcome to so this our participants Okay, so Deborah, like we said before, this is our workshop and we are about to start with this. <coughs> but before starting, we usually have warm ups or something we call energizers just to ginger our participants up in order for them not to be down <coughs> when the workshop is going on. So, as you can see, they are all standing up in the circle form. This is what we usually do, and this is called circle circle. And it's something that we, activity that we call to gather all the participants in a circle form. So, as you can see, it's going on. And they are about to start with the warm up. So, fishbowl is just 
an activity which involves the participants think critically at issues raised up by their facilitator. So with this, the participants are going to talk on their own about the issues. <laughs> Okay, Deborah, we've just finished with the fishbowl activity as you were watching over here with the three chairs in the middle and people coming to give their views of ask questions. And now we are about to start with our rehearsals, our performances. We just went back and planned on our things, so we are coming to show our stories to you. So Deborah, my story, the performance that we've been having is all about human rights and gender. A girl who was maltreated by her mother's friend and later sacked and was not also allowed to go to school. Okay, and my story is on teenage pregnancy. A girl called Dede who, were, who came from a very poor background, who in, later on, because of financial problems, she has to visit her boyfriend in order to have sex with her. And that's leading, that led her to teenage pregnancy. Hello Debra, this is the end of our workshop and we would like to see you having your workshop with your focus groups as we did. And we yeah, and as we said earlier on, you people use scripts in having your performances, but ours is not that. Ours is performances from our own participants as you saw over there in the two performances. And then also we'd like to know the relationship between the writers who are involved in you with your script writing. And then also we'd like to see more of your workshops to know how you go about your script writing since we don't know anything about that. And to add to that, I would like to ask about your anniversary next year. How is it going to be like? We, 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 need, we, we need your plan about how things are going to work next year. And we also hope it is going to be a successful one to you and to your group as well. Bye bye. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. <laughs>